What's up guys, today we are making a new enclosure for our tarantula that is actually on the way. So let's just get right into it and add some soft screen. Here I'm adding my own mix, I'll drop it in the comments if you want to. It has a lot of critters and we want a deep layer so the tarantula can dig. And I'm just spreading it out with a deep layer and a little more in the back than the front to create a sense of depth. Now I'm adding in this piece of wood that I found and I thought it would look very good uh, for this terrarium specifically. And now I'm just creating a little startup burrow for the tarantula that he hopefully will take. And then I just add some more substrate in behind the wood and where I just think it needs it so it looks like it's been there a while and looks more natural. And I think that looks pretty good, so um, let's just move on to the crocodile skull. I thought this would look good in here, so I just added it. And now we're adding in some uh, plant cuttings, not a whole lot, because the tarantula will mo probably trample them and they won't grow that good in here anyways. So I'm just trying it out and adding a few plants, mostly in the back where he won't be that much. And that is all the planes I want to add in here. But I did also want to add some moss, so I just did that. And then I add in some leaf litter. And that's pretty much it. So we are adding in a cleanup crew. I don't think I need it, but I just added in it in anyway. These right here are Porcelio Pruneosis powder orange, I think, and I just have the terrain right here under some good lighting next to all my other smaller escapes. And right here, you can see the dips, dips, I don't know how to say that, but it's the substrate is pretty deep, and I think we are ready. So, a couple days later, it arrived, and I had some struggle with opening this so I put the camera down and then opened it with two hands and now I'm just wrapping the toilet paper up and right here he is at first I thought he was dead because he wasn't moving at all and curled up a little bit but turns out he was just fine so I put the camera on this room and then added him in I think he looks very good in here and a couple of days later I tried offering food and he took it. So he's doing very well and stay tuned for some updates on him. But that's pretty much it for this video. Like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.